Hey everyone, it's Tori again. It's been a little while since my last video. Um, been going through some stuff. A lot of stuff has been going on. Um, construction in my street is still going on, so that's great. Um, I say it was so sarcastically. Um, my dog dragged me across a baseball field. That was maybe two weeks ago and I still have the bruises on my legs and I've decided what I'm gonna be for Rhode Island Comic Con um, and maybe Halloween because I might use it for both because my original Halloween plan might not work out um, excuse my ugly faces but other than that, that's pretty much it. Um, my dad went camping, so I've been here alone for a little while. Yeah, pretty much it. So, um, I actually wanted to talk about something. So I went to Walmart and spent $80 on healthy food because I like to eat healthy. I don't even really eat meat that often. Um, and if I do, it's only white meat, it's not red meat. And I went dressed like this. So, crop top, which, you know, I've got a front facing camera and I'm using my cell phone and I can't bend my wrist that way. But, actually, let me see. Excuse my blinds. They felt like getting in the shot. So essentially, that's what I went dressed as. And being a bigger girl, pant size, like 13, 14, um, it was kind of nerve-wracking for me. Um, But despite some of the dirty looks that I got, I also got people defending me to people that they were with. Like, there was this one lady who was like, oh, she shouldn't be wearing that. Just kind of to be expected, you know, I'm 188 pounds now. Um, I mean, I was like 199, just like 200, so... Um, and then I started walking and exercising and eating healthier, and I completely quit soda altogether. The only thing that I drink is an occasional ginger ale, and that's only when my stomach's, like, severely upset. Um, but this one woman goes, she shouldn't be wearing that, and her friend goes, what do you care? If you don't like it, stop looking. It takes courage for a bigger girl to wear stuff like that. I mean, I'm mostly muscle, but I do have a tummy, and I don't have a thigh gap, and it took a lot for me to actually say I'm going to go food shopping dressed like this. Um, just out of pure laziness, I really didn't want to change. Um, but overall, I think I got mostly a positive outlook on it, which sort of helped with my self-confidence, because my boyfriend's always telling me, babe, you're beautiful, babe, you're fine. And, you know, I just recently started believing him. But now, you know, I guess the, the proof is in the pudding. Ooh, I don't like pudding. Hmm. I have to find a different replacement for that expression. Um. Yeah. Caught a couple of guys looking at me too. That was a little weird. Not sure if I like that attention. Um, but it's like 80, like 7 degrees I think right now with like a pretty nice breeze. So I was like, why not wear jean shorts in this shirt? Um, even if I am just sitting in the house, which I ended up not. But I'm going to for the rest of the day probably unless I take my dog out for a walk. Um which will not be on the same route as I did last night, because for those of you who actually pay attention on my Facebook, if you have me on Facebook, um, somebody threw chicken out the window, which looked like it was like KFC or something like that, or Popeye's or popular chicken restaurant, um, and they left it on the sidewalk in a place where dogs frequent. 
Um, the park owners removed the trash barrel from that area just because they know the dogs frequent it. But somebody decided that it was going to be okay to throw chicken on the sidewalk. My dog pulled away from me and would not let me pull it out of his mouth. So I ended up having to kick it out of, out of his mouth. And I cut my leg open on the chicken bones. If it was sharp enough to cut my leg, it's a danger for my dog. It's a danger for all the dogs that frequent the area. And when I kicked it, it went out into the middle of the street and I grabbed my dog and I lifted up his gums, making sure he wasn't still chewing on any part of it and that I didn't loosen any of his teeth because I kicked the damn thing pretty hard, but I didn't kick his face. You know, I just kicked the chicken out of his mouth. Um, he seems to be doing okay. He's actually eating his food right now, I think. Are you eating your food, puppy? <laughs> He's just looking at me. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I have a PS4 now. And my boyfriend and I are tag teaming Lego Dimensions, which is badass, by the way. We're obsessed. Um, that's probably him texting me now. He's a truck driver, so he's just letting me know how many stops he has left. Um, Tyson, come here. Say bye to the people. Say bye to the people. Who's a good boy? Say bye. <laughs> He's such a cutie. Um, anyway, so that's pretty much it. I'm going to try to keep you guys updated. And I might be doing a makeup tutorial soon. Not entirely sure. Um, and I'm going to try to post videos more often. Okay. Thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe. Do all the dewy things. And um, also, for the record, I don't own any of the songs that are playing in the background. I just keep my radio on, like, all day long. So...